Hey guys, happy, happy Sunday. I'm having a really good day today because I found the jar. So I haven't had a jar in such a long time that I'm really excited to see what's in here. And before I go ahead and start and open this, I want to let you guys know that I am doing the giveaway. Uh, and I showed in the previous video, if you haven't seen the previous video, uh, please go to it and make a comment under there. This is not the, the, uh, the video for the giveaway. The one previous to this is, I will put the link in below in the description and go just go and make a comment and uh and doesn't matter where you are i will send it out worldwide okay so i did <laughs> i did look at the at the signature and it says esperanza uh, it's a beautiful native ring and it will fit everybody it's an adjustable ring uh, it is signed in the back as well and it does have these beautiful carnelian um, stones here very beautiful and i'm giving this as an appreciation to all of you guys and I don't know, just giving away things makes me happy. So uh, this is going to be uh, the giveaway. So we're going to go ahead and, and do the jar here. It's $29.99. And I do see a lot of fun stuff in here. And I did notice this piece here, um, this one over here. I just hope it's nothing is broken on that one. I, I know that, that um, that's an alabaster piece. But we'll see what's in uh, We'll open it up and see. And I did notice a lot of, you know, fun stuff in here. It's colorful. So let's go ahead and, and get to it hope you're all having a great uh weekend today i'm actually in a much better mood today than i have been in a few weeks now so yeah and if you haven't watched my video uh previous to this one i'm gonna put that down in the link for you not only to um go ahead and make a comment under but also to watch because i did find a lot of uh great stuff uh from still from that hundred pound lot that lot just keeps on giving and giving. I still have so much more to go through. And I have made multiple trays that I'm going to show you guys. So let's go ahead and, and do this. Oh, no, I forgot my... Oh, no, I didn't. I brought it. <laughs> oh, and guys, uh, this was a piece of amber here. I did go ahead and test it, and it is amber. It's gorgeous, huge chunk. And it's, this, uh, it's not anything, the metal on this, but this is amber. Uh, this piece here was not sterling. It, it had a little tag that said 925, but it's not. But it is a beautiful, fun piece here. And guys, look. Yeah. But guys, when something says 925 and it is being picked up by the magnet, uh, it could be because it has a uh, rodent plate. <laughs> now I'm going to get get tongue-tied on how to say that word. Rhodium plated. And that does have a mag, uh, that does that is magnetic. They do use that to coat it with for protection and for it to look nice and shiny. I don't think this is the case on this one, but a lot of the times jewelry does have that plating, and it is slightly magnetic, not like this, but it is it'll dance with the magnet. But yeah, so just because it picks it up with the magnet doesn't always mean that your item is not sterling. It might be plated. Uh, so yeah, you, you want to look into that. I don't know 100% way besides showing it to a jeweler to, to, uh, to know the, to know which is which, but I know that a lot of um, department stores like Macy's and then, and JCPenney and stuff like that do have uh, items there that are rolling plated and they will say on the package, but for us finding things out of jars, it's, it's difficult uh, to know uh, which is which from there. So let's go ahead and do this. Yeah, don't forget to uh, go ahead and make a comment for the giveaway. And the giveaway I'll do I'll do next uh, Saturday or Sunday. Okay, so there's some plasticky beads here. I see just some vintage beads. Here's a hair piece with the smile now and cry later gold tone. Here. A necklace with okay, no marks on this one. And this one has it's a bezel set necklace. Oh, that's quite long. Uh, but these are plastic beads, they're not uh, crystals. Still pretty. For the you know the flapper look, it looks nice. Oh, we have a two here and oh, that's cute. Look, glittery, glittery earrings in a fuchsia color. It's very clean. They don't have the packs. 
so far. Because everything seems clean. Uh, we have a bracelet hinged with a spoon or fork uh, backs on this one. And I like these uh, jewelry that they make, especially the rings. One moment, please. Okay. And we're going to look for marks. And where did my... Here it is. Okay. I usually never hardly make more than one video a week. This is, I just got really excited because I found the jar. Okay. No, nothing on here. And we have a pendant. No marks. Really pretty. Dangle. Uh, I don't see anything missing. Just needs a chain. Okay, oh, it's your cross. We have a vintage rosary. It says Italy here. Guys, I got a lot of messages about my rings yesterday in my email. This one I'm definitely going to keep because it's a gift. But this one I'm thinking right now if I should put it up or not. Let me wear it today too and I'll decide. But this one definitely it's a gift. I'm keeping that one. But this one I can let go. But I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> I did get your messages. <laughs> okay. So oh, we have the... Oh, good. Okay. This is good. All the earrings I'm finding paired up. Uh, beautiful green beads here. Very sparkly. Great for Christmas, holidays. And... This one is just the plastic piece here. And no marks. Oops, getting a phone call. Give me a second. Okay. This. What is this, guys? Ooh. I don't know about this one. It's fuzzy and I don't know. Oh, cross only and. I'm trying to find the end. Oh, look at that. Okay, here's the clasp. Okay, so this is Lucky Brand. Okay, I've never seen one like this before. This is just like strands, and I don't know what this is. Some kind of crochet work on here. It's a nice large uh, antique gold piece, but I don't know, guys. <laughs> what do you guys think? I don't know. <laughs> I don't like that, you know, jewelry with uh, crochet pieces. Okay. So this one here is, okay, it looks like it's maybe it was a keychain and broke. Purses. Okay. And we have a glass piece here. Looks kind of like a dicoric glass. Very pretty. It's a pendant. I like the colors. A watch and it says China in there and let's see quartz it's glittery um let me check and see if it's working um nope not working it's very clean though okay uh, another necklace here with, there's nothing on the tag Okay. Oh, I love this. It's a beautiful, beautiful chain. This would look cool with that uh, one that I found yesterday here. This piece. And oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> that looks perfect together. And th these you can these are magnetic. You can wear it just like this with this as the pendant, or you can throw it in the back. Or you can wear it like this, or depends on your preference. This looks cute on here. Okay, so I found a chain for the for the pendant. <laughs> okay, we have a holiday one here. It's a cat with rhinestones holding a little Christmas tree enamel. It does have a little mark there, JJ. Okay, and we have this African bead. Stretch bracelet, it is glass. These are trade beads. 
It's nicely, it's very cute. Okay. And we have this one here with fuchsia and turquoise. What does this say? Um, sometimes you just can't read it. <laughs> I don't know, guys. It's a H E L M. I don't know. I can't read. I cannot read it. But yeah, it's a nice piece. Okay. Um, I see these two earrings here. Okay. Glass teardrop shape. Very cute. Glass earrings. I just need backs. And I have a bunch of backs. <laughs> oh, okay, guys. It's falling apart here. Um, this one is by Guess. Yeah, the, uh, the band definitely needs to be changed, but this seems to be in pretty good condition. I don't see any rhinestones missing. It's a really pretty one. It has the Mother of Pearl face in there. Ooh, my son's being loud over there. Ooh, okay, a little turtle. I'm not sure what it's made of. Looks like it's for an uh, anklet. And we have um, it's a little Versace looking pendant there. Ooh, wow. Okay, yeah, when the kids are home, they get really loud. <laughs> and they've been home pretty much all year, I would say. I'm a teacher now. <laughs> teaching the kids, you know, with the schools and everything. It does get frustrating at times, but what can we do? It is what it is. And, you know, the kid, I don't know, guys, the kids are really feeling bad staying at home all day. And I don't think, you know, the Zoom thing is really bad for their, I think it's really bad for their eyes. Always in front of the screen for six hours. It's a lot. What is this? Okay. Purple plastic these might be bakelite i've seen some of these that are bakelite i don't think this one is because it has seams but it's a cute little retro piece there we have this flower no marks this is really cute look at this a little bird painted bird um nothing there we'll see if we have the other one. Oh, cute little roadrunner Okay, uh, another brooch, Look, beads, a watch, why is it green, <laughs> it's green guys, it's green, <laughs> is it a sticker, okay guys, the sticker is green, it's not green, and let's see what it says, citizen, um, it says something else, be elegant citizen elegance that's pretty though and oh okay it's way too small but it is a really nice piece you can tell okay too bad have a little fly bee little insect here oh this is marked too okay guys what is this say roman roman Okay, whoa, hang on. I'm going to go check on the kids. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I'm sorry about that. Okay, where was I? Oh, my God. Okay, I just had to give the kids some cookies. <laughs> okay, so this one here is a uh, moon with a little boy and a, and a girl sitting in the moon. And no marks for this one as well. And we have... An elephant, and then okay. Oh, this one here fell out, and this does look like it's silver. Okay, see a mark here, and nine two five, and I don't know two letters. I can't see them. L A. Okay, and it's oh boy, it's dirty. I can't even see what it says. A sister is forever a forever friend. That's really cute. Okay, this needs to be cleaned up, obviously. Oh, it's quite big, too. Okay. 
maybe it needs to be like squeezed in a little bit yeah yeah it's a pretty big one <laughs> maybe a size eight i would say let's for a size eight wrist next we have earring i'm gonna put the earrings aside this is pretty quilted design okay so and the bird and we have a pretty enamel cloisonne looking one here one with stones and this is pretty the little tassel okay we have this it says la radiant and new york and some numbers <laughs> i don't know guys <laughs> it's a fashion piece okay and we have this one what does this say is that a g I don't or a i think oh i think it says honey honey i'm not sure this kind it looks more like a g though i don't know guys i think it's it makes more sense for it to say honey <laughs> it's cute okay if it says something else put it into the comments because that's what i see uh glass bangle oh this won't fit usually the glass bangles won't fit me oh what's this over here mm. uh, just little marks okay it's not broken oh we have this one that says pauline and a little oh i can tell it is it does have a designer over here let's see who it is stella dot and it says pauline okay so if anyone's a pauline let me know <laughs> okay we have a glass beaded cute little charm bracelet and oh looks like little mickey mouse head here it's cute okay so far so good guys i'm happy <laughs> a little indian looking handmade it says florida state the leaf and it says emmons it's really pretty oh this is cute okay we have a bracelet here hinged no marks really pretty faceted beads here that's cute enamel really nice and clean another brace oh it's a snake this is so cute it has black and white enameling and then some rhinestones here and checking to see if there's any missing i don't see any no maker's marks but this is also a nice piece here very cute and then we have this one okay this is also lucky brand very cute enamel flowers and crocheted uh, bracelet this is pretty too okay so so far so good <laughs> oh a christmas tree with little round stones in there no marks and we have this one here it's a toggle clasp necklace with all colors of, of uh, metals here as a necklace and we have this one and another brooch with a little marble looking stone okay so now we get to this one okay so this is alabaster it's a little uh, i think this is a, a calendar an aztec calendar cute green oh it's missing 
Oh no, it's not. That's the clasp. It's the clasp. I thought it was missing the stone, but it's the clasp. So it seems to be in, in, in one piece here. Very pretty. Another watch. And we have Pirates of the Caribbean. Okay, we have the made to this one here. No marks. Looks like stainless steel and a hair, of course. Okay, we oh oh no ew okay. We have a jade cross and we have the mate to this one here. Cute tortoise looking one. Oh, this is pretty. A butterfly ring. Two-toned. Oh, let's see. It's marked or not. Oh, I don't see anything. No. Mm, no marks. It's a really pretty ring. Okay. We have this one here, a true strand necklace with the heart. Oh, it is a locket. Oh boy, I have to get one of those locket snappers. <laughs> okay, nothing inside, and it says, I love you. Very lightweight. Oh boy. Okay, look at this. <laughs> a big chunk of dyed howlite red. Okay, we have a cross. Oh, that's pretty. It has a little flower center. Really cute. Okay, so I see the mate to this one here, the tassel flower. And enameling. And it's marked with a little tiny flower over there. I don't know what that is. If anyone knows, please put it into the comments. Oh, oh my goodness, look at these beauties. How sparkly. No uh, makers, but look at these. Okay, these maybe I'm going to keep. These are hu huge, <laughs> beautiful, sparkly stones. I mean, the video is not doing it justice. And my son probably wants another cookie because he's over there making a whole bunch of noise. Okay, this is pretty. It's a ring with some type of um, peridot stone. I don't, it doesn't look silver, it looks pewter. And it's marked inside, what does it say? Oh my God, I can't see. I cannot see what it says. Hmm. Oh, don't you just hate that? I'm gonna check with my phone, uh, the camera on my phone, cause sometimes that'll, sometimes it's easier to see with that, but oh, let's see. Oh boy. He really wants my attention right now. Okay, it says lucky. Lucky you. So it's a lucky. <laughs> it's a lucky brand ring. It's very pretty. Maybe a size six and three fourth, I would say, because it's not it's not fitting me. So this is really pretty. Okay. Oh, another earring paired up. Okay, these are plastic, but these are really heavy. No marks or anything, okay. But they're heavy and 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 it's plastic, so I don't know. Metal is really heavy. Then we have the Timex watch and a charm bracelet with the Hello Kitty, and it does have the Sanyo. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, but this is when this is how you know if it's a uh, it's not one of the fake ones. This is a real one. <laughs> and yes, there are the fake ones. Lots of fake ones out there. So this is actually from from um, from them. Okay. This is interesting. Okay. It's a coil little bracelet here with some howlite beads. It's very pretty on the memory wire. And we have an 
okay, what is this saying here? It says stainless, so it's a stainless steel enamel ring. We have another ring here. Please be silver. <laughs> Look how cute this is. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Oh my god. Hang on, guys. Let me go give him another cookie. I'll be right back. Back. Uh, I looked inside. It says NVC and then six. So I'm guessing it's a fashion ring size six. I don't know what the NVC is, but it has a really pretty glass uh, faceted uh, stone here that looks like blue topaz. Very cute. And then the side ones are a little bit darker blue. Very nice. And then we have this one here. Oh, no. Now they're arguing. <laughs> Kids do not play nice. Okay. Why? Okay, this one says 14K CRG. This is, okay. Well, we're going to have to test it then. Let me see if there's anything else on the other side here. Italy. Huh. Could it be? Could it be? Let it be. <laughs> Uh, where's my little magnet here? Okay, so we're gonna test this. This might be gold, guys. Okay. Then we have this one here with beautiful stones as well in silver tone. No marks. We have a ring that says purity. And I see some marks here on this one. 925. So we, this one is silver as well cute ring oh <laughs> whoa <laughs> this is huge chico's we have a chico's brand large oh my goodness wow okay a wow ring <laughs> okay and it's really clean and it's a, a stretchy ring okay, we have another ring here uh, with a faceted crystal here i Oh, okay, so this one has that little, I forgot what this is called, where it has the little, uh, you know, the ring thing inside where it sizes on your finger, where, yeah, it adjusts, it's like, it's kind of like an adjustable thing. It's really pretty, and I don't see any marks on here, nope. I know Avon makes those type of rings, but it doesn't, doesn't say anything. Oh, look at this guy. Okay, it's a dragon with rhinestone eyes, silver and gold tone. Really cute. Nice. Okay, so I found the other earring here for this one, the mate. Have gold. Very clean. Usually these are green in the back and they have verdigris, but this is clean. Okay, another ring here. Oh my gosh, Avery925. Guys, we have a James Avery one. This is my second James Avery piece that I've ever gotten out of a jar. Oh my God. Please fit, please fit. <laughs> no, it doesn't fit. That means it's in the sixes, maybe six and a half. Oh, and it has those religious fishes on here. Really cute. It's in really good condition. I'm happy. Guys, I'm so happy about this jar already. And I see another ring. Let this one be Avery too. <laughs> okay. Uh, this looks silver as well. Okay. Uh, this one says M or NWS925. Okay, so this one is not. But this is a really pretty piece too. It looks like, kind of like that uh, Celtic knots on here. Okay, so. Okay, guys, I'm, things are looking up for the jars today. <laughs> okay, I have the other, other one to this, but this has a lot of wear. So I'm going to go ahead and put it in crafts. Let's see what else we'll find. So we found gold. We found Avery. <laughs> what is this? Oh. Okay, so it's missing stones, but look how beautiful it is. It's a little turtle. It says Aldo. Oh, that's too bad. Okay, 
Um, this is going to go into crafts. Uh, we have a holiday brooch here, little poinsettia. Okay, what is this? <laughs> oh my goodness, it's heavy glass. And I don't know if they're lips or if it's a heart. Yeah, I don't know. You tell me. It resembles bold. Very heavy. Okay, we have another ring here, but okay, I see where on here, so this is not silver. Put that in another lot. Okay, we have a cute little ring here with a flower and then uh, two turtles on the sides, but it's so dirty that I can't see. <laughs> I can't see uh, the tur turtles clearly, and this does look like one of those Hawaiian flowers. I forgot what it's called. Oh my god! Again, it's it's can't remember okay um i want to see if it's marked inside and yes it does say nine to five inside it's a pretty piece okay we have some more rings oh this is another flower okay this one has a stone inside and two little leaves on the side but these need some really good cleaning <laughs> they're very dirty and i have a rhinestone ring I'm checking to see if they're all there. Yes, they're all there. None missing and colorful. Oh my goodness, guys. My son's driving me crazy today. And we have another bracelet here. And oh boy, he is getting loud today because he's not getting what he wants. Okay. Yeah, this is silver as well. I don't know if the beads are, but the clasp is, I will check. So I'm getting a lot of silver pieces in here, guys. This should be silver too. It has real pearls. And here's the clasp. Okay, the clasp says 925, so we have a bracelet. But all of these need to definitely be tested, and I'll let you guys know in the next video. Oh, wow. Lot, oh, lot. I didn't realize that this is so much silver. <laughs> Okay, so lots of great pieces. Oh, and I'm wearing one. Okay, so that's a lot. Uh, this looks silver too. And oh boy. Okay, guys, I'll try to be quick. I want to go see what's going on. Okay, this has a signature. I don't know if it's silver or not. I cannot see the signature. It's so tiny. But it is abalone here and a little pearl. And I will test that one as well. And we have a few more things to go, and I am really happy about this jar. This jar made me happy today. Okay, so this, did we have the other one or no? I don't know. I don't know where it went if we did. <laughs> okay, so I don't know about this one. I think we did have it. I'm not sure. Okay, we have a watch by Avenue. Really large watch here. Hmm. I don't know, guys. I don't really like doing or selling watches, so I don't make, make watch lots. I do put them in a lot. Okay, there's some crystals here. They are glass. Beautiful. And we have this piece here, leather, and some crystals. And, oh, okay, so this is a, I think this is one of those, you know, bracelets, and I'm not wrong. Okay, let's see. Let's see if it'll go all the way around. No, it won't. <laughs> it won't. So it's a choker. And we have a stretch one here, a bracelet that's very stiff. I don't want to stretch it because it's going to break. I'm going to go ahead and put that in press. Or... And we have a mask here, brass. Okay, so this so it has it says 925 in here. Uh, 925 ND. And it's a pendant brooch. And, of course, it needs cleaning. Everything in here was... Uh, the silver ones were really dirty okay we have this i'm trying to see if we have a match uh, i don't see it okay so no match to this earring here it's a pretty one though it has a little red stone okay what is this here it's a bracelet and it's by premier design it's a really pretty one very clean and this is the last one in the jar. 
And this one is Ankline. Here's the little little lion. And it's just white and gold beads. So, yes, don't forget to um, go to the previous video and make a comment for the giveaway. I'll put the link in, in the description. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Mm, my favorite is this one here. I love this. And then, oh my gosh, these are so beautiful. So beautiful. These earrings. This one is pretty. We got all these silver pieces, the James Avery piece. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh. Where'd this come from? <laughs> okay, so oh guys, it's okay, so it was mixed in with the silver stuff I put over here. So we do have the match to this earring. Um I don't know if it's silver here. Let's see. Let's check while we're at it. And no, I don't see any marks or anything in on this one. So where were we? And this dragon I really like. I love this piece here. This one, the the ring from Lucky Brand. That's pretty. Uh, what else do I like here? Oh, this is another one of my favorites. This piece here is so so pretty and beautiful. And what else? Okay, the earrings are nice too. And let me see. This one is really cool. And I'm sure, oh, the Christmas tree. Oh, this I will put up in that seat. It's really pretty. Somebody will really like that. We have, oh, and this. Oh, another one of my favorites. And this one as well. This one. And I like this. So, yeah, there was a lot of fun stuff in here, guys. Oh, let's not forget this kind of, this is really pretty too. Okay, so I got, if I have to choose one, one thing that was my favorite, one thing, one thing, I would say um, this, the necklace over here. And second would be the earrings. Let me know which one's your favorite. And if there's anything that you would like uh, from here, please go ahead and leave in the comments and I'll try to put it up as soon as I can, guys. Thank you for watching. This is Anita Fanita saying goodbye.